do you feel safe in London now? Yeah, absolutely. When I was a teenager, so that's about 20 years ago, uh, a bit longer, um, you know, actually London was a lot more unsafe. You were much more likely to have, you know, some random person or gang walk up to you and stop you and demand your phone. And if you didn't get hand it over to them, you'd get punched or something like that. That happened to me loads of my friends when I was a teenager. It doesn't really happen so much now. People do have their mobile phones snatched out of their hands when they're walking along the, the street by people on bikes. That's a particular kind of crime that is definitely more common these days. Um, shoplifting, we talked about earlier, that's more common. But generally, violent crime is really significantly down and other forms of crime are down in London and across the country. It's just that we're talking about them more. And that's important. Yeah, no, it's, it's definitely important. Well, what are your views, Emma? Well, I was going to say, just, just to the issue of uh, feeling safe in London, because it's an interesting one. We hear so much about how dangerous London is. And I have been vocal about, you know, what I the, the failings of Sadiq Khan, the newly re-elected mayor um, of London, and the knife crime, the stabbings around, you know, well, specifically around East London, but also all over London, in fact, and all around the country, which seem to be going unchecked. But actually, as a Londoner born and bred, as someone who's lived here all their lives, I've never, and as a woman on her own, you know, often out and about on my own, I've never felt, I've never felt threatened. I've never felt, I've never been mugged. I've never been harassed, particularly, you know, maybe, maybe a bunch of lads shouting at you when I was a teenager or whatever, but I've never felt particularly unsafe in London. However, I have a three-year-old son and I do worry very much about how this will be in 10 years time when he's a young lad, when he's a teenager out and about on the streets of London. Because where I live in in London, central London, but to the east, you know, every night you hear police helicopters hovering overhead. Every night you hear about stabbings and arrests and and violence on the street. So it is it is a difficult time. 